Hello guys! Thank you for clicking on my video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to see more because I know you're going to want to see more. Why wouldn't you want to see more? Um, please be sure to follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook at Nails by Lil Holly and click that notification bell so that you get notified whenever I post a video because why wouldn't you want to get notified whenever I post a video? In this video, you will see my nail tech setup. Um, I am in a shop currently, so you'll see like how I have everything set up in my own little sections. Um, and I see a lot of home-based nail salons and how they're set up, so I think coming from this environment will give you guys some cool ideas. Um, so yeah! Keep watching! Okay, so when my client first walks in, they see this lovely picture frame <laughs> um you turn to the left and usually this is a waiting area but you know covid um and then we have the barber the barber's shy then you come in here walk down this hallway here you turn this way and there's hairdressing stations we got two of them um there's these racks we have so many <laughs> that you could hang your purse your keys your coats and then to this left, we have the hair shampooers. I'm not a hairdresser, so I don't really know all that stuff. But here is what you are, you know, waiting for. <laughs> okay, so we have my colored swatches here. They are labeled, so then my client could just come in and figure out. These are my gel polishes, so usually they're on this hook. Um, but we have my light colored acrylics here and my more dark acrylics here. And usually they just tell me to do whatever I want, <laughs> so we don't really use them too much. but. It's an option. Then here we have my lovely, lovely, oh, let it focus. My lovely client chair. It's super comfortable on wheels. <laughs> um, we have this lamp here that I don't really use. Um, we have my drill. I got my drill from Koopa. I really love this drill. I recommend it 100%. <laughs> um, we have my first dollar here from my mom. When she, like she was my first customer in the shop and she left my dollar and everyone knows that that's good luck. Here, I have all my brushes. Um, I, re I use this every single appointment. So it's sitting right here. Cause you know super easy to grab these are what I use um they came with my business cards but I use them when I hand paint and I just kind of put some globs of gel polish on here and when I'm done I wipe it off I really need to invest in one of those little marble things um here this is my let me get it open my jewel pen so I keep that in a case in here and literally all my brushes. And then we have these beautiful lights. And then when you come down, there's a mirror. Let me give you guys a good look at this mirror. It's so big and so cute. Super cute, super cute. Um, here we have my lucky cat. I had it ever since I started, so it definitely means a lot. I need to put batteries in it so that the arm moves, <laughs> but you know, that's beside the point. And then this here, my favorite cousin got me that. It's so cute. Here 
here I have my Barbicide. Um, I got this from Amazon. You, the, this top shelf comes off and you set it in here and then it just like goes under the Barbicide and that was definitely, everyone, every nail tech needs that. Every nail tech, barber, whatever. Like if you use Barbicide, I definitely recommend. Um, this ring light I got from Best Buy. I'm really trying to get rid of it. Um, <laughs> I really want something that like goes over my nail desk here. Um, still looking for that. Here I got this armrest from Amazon. And then I also, these nail tech hack. This is a dental bib, um, but it's, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, waterproof I cannot think of that word <laughs> it's waterproof and oh my gosh that that hack will save your life um, I always put a paper towel down here on this hook I have my mask then I have an extension cord running along the side and then down to my lovely cart it's kind of messy at the moment but you know um, <laughs> here I have my monomer, I have my acetone, I have another monomer. I put my monomer in this, um, yeah, I have some cuticle oil, some alcohol. These are like my go-tos, everything I use. So I have my clear top coat, my gel, well they're all gel, but my top coat for my manis, my base coat for my manis, um, my nail prep. I have my bonding, I have my matte gel top coat, and my jewels, and my jewel glue. Um, this is, let me see here, Zule. Ooh, this is Zule. If you're a nail tech and need some jewel glue, that is the best one out. And I seen that they recently came out with a new packaging um, or tube with this. The lid never goes on, but I was doing some research and I heard or read that it's supposed to be like that because it's super strong glue. Um, once you put the lid back on, you're not gonna be able to get it off. So that's the only problem with that. Um, I have some cotton, cotton um, lint-free rags. Here is where I use, where I do, Here is where I keep my files. I use a new file on every client, so that's there. I also keep my foil gel here and some some extra stuff. And I keep my buffer in here. I also keep my square on hand for when people wanna pay with card. Um, my sanding bands I keep here as well, medium grit. I keep a dappin dish here, my glue hack as well. Um, I don't know where the rest of my nail techs keep their glue, but I keep it in this little baggie just so like I can see it all the time. Um, then I have my drill bit holder, my extra glue, some sanding bands. This I got from Koopa. I've had it for some time now, but it literally holds all my drill bits. This is an old container from Coco and Eve, um, but it's great for holding my clear acrylic because I use it so much. Um, so that's great. Um, here I have my fur that I use to like take my pictures. I also have my foils. I keep my roll of paper towels down here, um, and then my most used tips are here, and then I have some foils for when I want to do those. I have my mini colored acrylics down here with my Kiera Sky lamp. And as well as my duster that I got that duster from Amazon. Um, I don't recommend it. <laughs> that um, dust collector doesn't pick up 
like everything I needed or suck up everything I needed to suck up <laughs> um I have my little trash can that I got from Burlington that I need to take out today and then here under these drawers I have my gloves I have some business cards let me show you these business cards I got these business cards from Zazzle as well they have so many cute ones on there so I have that down here um, this drawer is all of my like decals my glitters it's kind of messy, but these drawers are small, so I don't have too much room. Um, these glitters are super popular right now because it is fall. I have my fall leaves in here. Um, and all that other stuff. <laughs> in this second drawer, I have all my rhinestones. I have my Swarovski crystals and literally everything else. Like my charms and then down here it's a cabinet down here I have all of my gel polishes they go all the way back there um, I only use my gel polishes for nail art um, which is why they're not displayed because I'm the only person that really needs to touch them or grab them um, these powders a lot of I kind of color coordinate them I tried to I've been pretty busy lately so I've just been kind of throwing them up there but we have majority of them are glam and glitz and then we have like Mia secret we're moving on to the back portion okay starting from the top um, it's this cabinet that they made space for me um, so I have some cotton some extra cotton I have extra mass my old lamp I also have up there um, and um, a container that I used to keep my Swarovski crystals in it's way bigger I'm gonna need it for something just not too sure yet <laughs> here I have my sterilization packets I have my dental bibs I have some buffers back there, some extra forms. I have my soak off containers. These, if you are a nail tech, I highly recommend. Got them from Amazon. I'll try to find the link and put it below. Um, but definitely, definitely get this. You pop this open. You put your hot water in there. Acetone goes at the top clip them in clip them in and they're good to go um, hot water just helps the acetone activate faster um, so I definitely recommend here I have my chunky glitters and then in this one here I have all of my loose glitters and extra stuff back there I have my clear acrylic I also have my white acrylic and then I also have my barbicide and my IBD top coat here I have my acetone I have my monomer I have some alcohol and then this I also got from Amazon so there's glass beads in here you plug it in and you put your implements in here um, it acts it acts as an autoclave so it kind of burns all that stuff off um, these nail brushes I got from Amazon it was like it was a pack actually yeah I think I got these from Amazon here I have all of my tips literally oh and I have um extra nail clippers in here as well so there is that I literally have like the rest of my like junk down here that I don't really use like some leftover snake skin um, my cuticle oils I have down here and extra glitters
Okay guys, that literally wraps up my video. You've seen everything I have at my nail tech station at the salon. If you have any questions on items that I got that I forgot to mention where I got them from, or if I like a certain product, my DMs are always open at Nails by La Holly on Facebook and Instagram. Um, you're more than welcome to leave a comment down below. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out from low.